Ooh, yeah. Oh boy. Oh, fine, fuck you then. <laughs> Motherfucking bullshit. <laughs> I don't want to tape this. There, bitch. Fuck you. <laughs> Alright. And now, doing the thing. Welcome to chapter 2 of Ultra Despair Girls. <laughs> well, I struggle my way through. This will be kind of fun, so here we go. So this is the very beginning of chapter 2. Minus, you know, the, um, looks like I can go either way here, can't I? Uh, minus the cutscene that kind of led me into it. If you want to see that, just go look at the last part. What's the point of going through the ticket gate? Total waste of money. But there's no gates. Huh? Did we pay? Oh, okay, so I can explore. Fuck you. What's the point of going through the ticket gate? Yeah, huh? yeah. Did uh, I get it. But there's gotta be stuff back there. There's always stuff back there. Why would you bother looking at the train? It's not moving. No shit. Yes, but we already knew that. Yeah. I know, but to see it in person like this makes me kind of down so shut up Kamaru jeez are you really going to get depressed over every little thing yeah you're right we should just walk along the railway then we'll be safe right no like I said earlier we can't know that for sure so leaving the lie works. so strongly just makes the truth that much more painful pop idols aren't virgins lottery numbers are fixed this world is much easier to deal with if you look at it rationally. I think you might have gone a bit off topic there. You're not really. For Thanks. now, there's no other option than to try, right? You're right. Something wrong, Toko? Are you worried about something? No, 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 not really. It's nothing. It's just... Didn't I tell you? I'm afraid of the dark. Is that all? There's something else bugging you, isn't there? Listen. I am if not you have strange. A bad feeling about this, or you can sense some kind of danger. What? Do you think I'm some kind of psychic danger detector or something? If we're gonna do this, let's hurry up and do it now. We'll have time to think later. The both of us. Okay. So if you have no idea why I'm playing this, it's because I've played Danganronpa 1 and 2, and then I've watched 3, so... Huh? Uh, okay. Yeah. I like the story. You can shut up! Quit judging me! I also like exploring the fuck out of levels, so please bear with me while I do that. There's usually collectibles in games like- oh, see? See? Yeah, but he's dead! Can I go down there? No, okay. This is a huge fucking train, by the way, as far as, like, perspective goes. I mean, I get it, it's a video game. Hold up, video, but... Ooh, what do I get here?
Okay. Is that it? Is that everything back here? Oh, no. No, it is not. See? It's worth exploring. Somebody's notes. I could read these out loud, that's... but... Whatever. So it looks like a top tier waifu simulator, this game, compared to the other ones, because you played as her brother, spoiler alert. Oh, oh no. Um, so you play as Kamaru's brother in the first game. So this is kind of like fan service, the game, but not really. I don't know. I feel like fucking. Oh, there's a Monokuma. I didn't know it'd be this dark. I knew it. I shouldn't have come here. Okay. This is a lot more engaging than the previous Danganronpa games. What? There we go. Alright! Level up. So on every level, I learned. Okay, I was expecting a fucking Monokuma to run out here. There we go. Every level, there's a collectible icon of one of the kids, the Warriors of Hope. Which is kind of funny they call themselves that, yet they lost for despair. I'm like full. Ooh, a thingy. A hit list, huh? <laughs> All right. That's kind of sad. We can get out of town from here, right? Okay. Can I go? Okay. Um, so the gameplay in this one is completely different from like the first two games. The For first... some reason, it's Excuse getting me. darker and darker. Shouldn't we start heading back now? Oh, don't say that. Let's just keep going a bit farther. Oh. We're not very good at throwing things, are we? <laughs> shield! The gun and grenades don't work! And we need to get out of here, boys! <laughs> oh, boy. We, we gotta run! Oh, shit. This is a dead end, isn't it? Get out of here, you piece of shit. Now, I bet you I could try using, uh... There's probably some gimmick to him. But I kind of doubt it. Anyways, I was saying the gameplay is a lot more engaging in this game than it is in, uh, say, uh, Danganronpa 1 or Super Danganronpa 2. I haven't played 3 yet because it's not on PC, but, you know. There's gotta be a trick to these stupid guard ones.
What's the point of going through the What? Huh? Okay. So there's guard Monokuma there. Figured that that much. So there must have been a trick to getting these guys to leave or killing them or getting out of there. At least I thought so. Maybe not. Maybe I'm looking in and thinking too hard. But that's what the game series is all about, is thinking. <sighs> I don't like the sprint button being B, that's kind of silly. Cumbersome. I hear him. Hear him. Watch a second, I pop my fucking head out here. Oh god! Come back here, you piece of shit. I think I broke the game. Oh, okay, that is how I was supposed to do it. Okay, so that was how I was supposed to do it. <sighs> All right. So now what? Is this the right way? I almost fully expect a fucking Monokuma to jump out at me now.
make it out of here alive? I'm definitely gonna marry faster! Stop raising your death flag! They all ran there. But okay. the case huh? but even if you can't escape you can still survive all you need to do is face them fight them fight toko what are you saying there's no way i can fight don't be so sure wait hold on over there huh What is it? A monitor? Is it some kind of trap again? Ugh, oh, it's a retarded kid. Huh? What's with this creepy little kid? Duh! Am I on already? Can I just, can I just skip this cutscene? I fucking hate this kid. Oh! gonna raise the curtain after Kotoko introduced me with a joke! Hey, is this kid with them too? Is he a part of that Warriors of Hope or whatever? Y yeah Yep! Yeah. I'm the priest, Jachiro Kimuri, a.k.a. Lil Ultimate Art. But I'll warn you now... Don't say my name out loud. It's a curse. D don't mess with me, brat. Take off that mask. I'm sweating just looking at it. N no, horrible. If I do that, your eyeballs are gonna explode. Huh? <laughs> Even I don't want to see that. Someone's eyeballs melting off because of my face. Oh, by the way, do you know? Is it just an urban legend that they use bugs to make food guy? This kid is so retarded. Wasabi and stuff with the taste and the color. It's suspicious. Uh. You, I'm sure you've heard this before, but you are totally gross. <laughs> Duh? Gross? I don't know. I think I'm a cheerful kid. Oh, maybe I... I just don't understand what cheerful is. Then I apologize. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. From the bottom of my heart, I'm so sorry. I beg you forgive me. I'm sorry. 
Enough already. You're grossing me out. Huh? You don't forgive me? If you don't forgive me, does that mean you hate me? <laughs> Let's get so damaged. Well, maybe not. Maybe you're just teasing me like boys who tease the girls they like. <laughs> I mean, if you guys are little boy lovers and just want to love me till you go crazy. Ugh. Even if we were siblings in a previous life, I'd still hate you. <laughs> what are you trying to say? I, I don't really get it. Well, I can understand that. This is like a yawn after all. It just comes out of my mouth involuntarily. All of his fucking dribble. Nobody can make anything of it. I don't even understand it either. Uh. This whole thing is just killing time. Just a distraction from the horrors around you. You guys must be pretty laid back if you're actually interested in what I'm saying. Believe me, I'm not. As expected of demons. I've had enough of this. Goodbye. Oh, wait, hold on! I was just trying to be nice. I wanted to tell you something. Tell us what? Um, it's regrettable, but the one with the wristband can't leave the city. C can't leave? Why? Well, you're a target for our game, right? The game isn't fair if there aren't any rules. Everything was already thought out. So that means there's a limit in this game. A limit? Don't tell me. The reason that boy exploded when he tried to leave the town swimming. Huh? D that's not our fault. It's not like we wanted him to blow up or anything. The wristband is made to explode. When the user goes outside the town without permission. Well, when I say it like that, I guess it kinda is our fault. <laughs> what? You should have said that in the first place. Omaro here was about to explode. <laughs> but some things are better left unknown. I don't say that all the time. It would be better for Mr. Pig. If he didn't find out he was about to be bacon, it doesn't change the fact that Mr. Pig is gonna die. So isn't it better not to tell him? Oh, d d don't go acting all philosophical about this. This game's rules are managed way too loosely. You're wrong! This isn't a game! I mean, people are dying! Yuda, he... He died, you know? To call what happened to him a, a game? There are some games that require you to risk your life. Huh. What do you mean? Hello? Can you not just ignore me? I don't like being ignored. Hey, um, which do you not like more? Being oh my ignored? God. Are ghosts? I don't like ghosts more. Ghosts are always cursing people and killing them all of a sudden. It makes me super mad. Stop it already! Stop saying things that make no sense! That's right. Just keep hating me. All you have to do is hate me. I'm from the hate planet, where being hated makes you feel good. And it's easier to just be hated. Oh my god. Oh, don't worry. I hate gross little boys like you to death. Huh. What you just said? Doesn't it kinda sound like love? If you flip it around? I was worried, so I had to make double sure. That's why I called you guys. Double sure? If you guys see this, you're gonna hate me even more! Ta-da!
Oh my god. Jesus fucking Christ. I'm not gonna look. I'm not gonna look. It must be something horrible. So this guy, I hunted him down at the shopping district. And this one, I hunted in the bathroom. <laughs> oh, are you disgusted? But I can't just stop. Making dioramas is like the only hobby I have. So how about it? I put a bad taste in your mouth, so now you hate me, right? Ugh. Or maybe you guys aren't affected by this because you have disgusting hobbies too. Ugh. Please, just stop already! Why do you want me to stop? Because you already hate me enough? Or because you don't wanna hate me? Because it's a waste of time? Because you're tired of it? Because you don't want to be? Uh. I mean, I don't know for sure. I'm just a kid. So I don't know what you really mean. Y you How crazy can you be? And if I am, whose fault is it? Well, it doesn't really matter. After all, I have so much fun now compared to before. I should thank Mr. and Mrs. Demons. I want to say... Thank you for teaching me that I'm nothing but ugly, nasty, worthless filth. This kid's damaged goods. I live like filth, surrounded by filth, inside this paradise where no adults can get in the way. <laughs> <laughs> Crying like a kid won't make them treat you like one. Are you really going to just accept it? Be their prey? If not, there's only one thing to do. You can't run, you have to fight. Like I said, that's impossible! No, it's not impossible. You have Master's gun, don't you? Kitty cat, hi you. Oh, he just ran for me. Oh, that's not what I mean. I'm not like you. I'm just a normal high school student who can't do anything, you know? Just running would be hard enough, but to fight? That's impossible. And just why do you think I'm here? What? I'm not telling you to deal with it on your own. You better not forget. I'm with you too. T Toko? I if it's impossible to do on your own, well then I guess I have to do it with you. So just a little more. Just fight a little bit more. It's okay to rely on you? Y you've already relied on me. Isn't it a bit late to ask that? You're right. Sorry. If you have time to apologize, might as well do it outside. The atmosphere here is... oppressive. Hey, Toko. I already told you, don't apologize. No, it's not that. Thank you. W what are you being so honest for? It's just... ugh, gross. <laughs> 
So come on, enough of that grossness, and let's hurry up and get outside. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's hurry and get outside. But I want to go down here. Yeah. It won't let me do it, Are will you it? Sure, we can get out that way. Um. I don't know. Th th then why are you going that way? Let's just go back the way we came. But I want to. Don't tell me how to play a video game, assholes. <laughs> well, yeah, I may as well save since I'm right here. Whatever. So a cutscene had to tell me I, I want to go this way. All right. There's too many of them. It's too dangerous to go that way. I don't want to go to Pornhub, Brick. Fuck you. <laughs> You're the worst. And what should we do? Don't ask me. I'm not your personal GPS. So sorry. You're just so reliable. I thought I'd ask. Reliable? Well, well, it is true that my brain is far superior to yours. Rude. Now, let's see. It might be better to head back underground for now, to find another exit. Back through the underground? Are you sure you're okay with that? What do you mean? I mean, you're afraid of the dark, aren't you? The underground is pretty dark. Shit! Oh! Are you trying to be an example? To show me how to go forward, even if you're scared. I see. As expected of a true mentor. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> okay. I know. Let me guess, it's gonna give me my thing as well. Is that a new kind of bullet? This looks pretty useful. But this gun belongs to Future Foundation, right? So why are the kids giving me bullets? I, I, I guess maybe there might be some kids in the group who want to support us. Huh? Support us? Mm. You know who, who it is. Cares about that right now? Let's just look for the exit. Nagito. It's Nagito. Spoiler alert. I'm yeah. pretty sure it's Nagito fucking with the stuff. He's got good luck here and shit like that. Anyways. Can I go this way now? It's oh. that shield guy again. Counter it with the new ammo. How do you know what that is? Anyways, um... Oh! Um...
Kinda love this soundtrack down here. Too much out of the question. This creepiness is just out of the question. He must be watching because <clears throat> what up, Bricks friends? And uh, oh, I think I just got caught by a ball gazer above the waist. I'm sorry, I, I guess I lose. <laughs> Isn't it just going to get darker if we keep going? Is it really going to be okay? It's Probably gonna be fine. That's assuming he is watching. I mean, I could have just replied Snapchat, but uh, Ooh, you suck at cheering people up. Um, you choose your well, I'm sure you're just laughing at me in your head, thinking I'm just some scared little girl. I should have a face cam up, but it's like dark. I don't have lighting. I'm not laughing about it. I don't like dark places either. But honestly. For some reason, I feel at ease. Why do you feel at ease? You enjoy taking pleasure in other people's suffering? Yes, yes I do. My suffering tastes delicious and you're planning on a four course meal, huh? That's kind of lewd. You sure have a bitchy personality. You're the type to talk trash at a wedding, aren't you? <laughs> okay. I, I didn't mean it like that. I just mean that I'm sure you're working hard too. Uh, of course. Even I'm at my limit. I'm scared of blood and the dark, and I'm just so tired, but th there's no choice but to do it. I'm not some crybaby, whiny, airheaded girl. Whiny? Crybaby? I hope she starts crying. <laughs> scared me <laughs> okay huh you really are an idiot i was just trying to ease the tension a little <laughs> yeah well now i'm more afraid of your stupidity than the dark <laughs> rude oh, sorry all right uh let's see anything here A shopping district underground like this? What was the administration thinking? Maybe it's subtle political satire? Hmm. Is this the one for my um. thing? Just like adults, some are good, some are bad. Don't waste time thinking about it. Then, do you think the ones who help us know it's wrong to kill adults? But now that you mentioned it, didn't you tell me like that before that? They seem like they're under orders. And didn't I just tell you it's a waste of time thinking about brats who've gone insane? If you have the energy to think about nonsense like that, use it for picking up your pace. Sorry. Well, sorry, I can't help but wonder about it. Now I can't help but wonder about it too. Wait. These kids power thrusting this chick? Uh. <laughs> 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 oh, yes! Awesome. Spike tunes off, everyone. Monokuma's coming from. Okay. Well, you just had to. Oh, okay. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> it just blows my mind if they have that in there. Alright. Aha! See? Exploring does things. <laughs> Wash hands before a meal. Why is that a kid's thing? Kids hate washing their hands. 
Reincarnating, huh? Oh my god. Hold in their poo all day after a big barbecue. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Toko, I think we can get out from those stairs. Y you're right. Let's head over there. Let's see. stuff over here so that's what games do okay so I gotta go through that door huh this door is it's a monokuma don't come near me I think the knockback ones are kind of <laughs> Feeling there's stuff behind doors. This door is locked. Okay, maybe not that door. It's that arcade machine again. Okay. Mini games. See, it looks like we can defeat them all in one go. Shoot that guy with dance and then blow him up. Use that hard. It's nice to have. Nice to have. <laughs> I don't know who this is. Hmm. I hear a Makuma. Okay. that I hear you fuckers Come on, let me use knockback. What is that? Someone's getting ambushed. We gotta go save them! Knockback. Someone, help me! Stop it! Please, stop! No! I don't wanna die! What? <laughs> Okay. 
Jesus Christ. I'm not great with consoles. So excuse me, bad shot. Sami? <laughs> it's Monokuma. What does this mean? Monokuma's beating up another Monokuma? That's surprising. I never figured robots would have internal discord. Okay, so it's not Osami. You know, it's kind of cute. Ugh. Don't be fooled. It's more unnatural if it's all white. It's like a curry plate without the curry. <laughs> Don't say that. We can be friends. I want to be friends with as many pretty ladies as possible. So she's some kind of exhibitionist or something? Suspicious, but I can see he has a pretty good eye. <laughs> Toko gets easily fooled too, huh? That's right. I have a good eye for judging character. For example, just by looking at your face, I can guess the time and date of your first kiss. Huh. Oh, what a horrifying function! <laughs> it's horrifying. I mean, if you can tell that about the first kiss, then you should know other firsts, right? Oh. If he uses that power, he can mercilessly expose frauds who claim to be virgins. Oh. Huh? Girl power is mostly from virginity. This is why so many girls try so hard to be seen as virgins. But okay. if we have this one's power, we can uncover the misdeeds of those fraudulent career women. <laughs> There's no mistaking it. This power can change the world. Oh. Uh, I was just giving an example. And what does this have to do with our current situation anyway? I guess you're right. I got a little heated there. Oh, yeah. By the way, what are you guys doing in a place like this? Fragile girls wandering around a dangerous place like this is a big no-no. What? Are you going to lecture us now? Excuse me, plugging my phone in. It's not our fault. We don't know where to go. I see. So you're drifters. Girls driven into a corner with nowhere to run. If that's the case, leave it to me. I can take you to a safe place. Huh? A safe place? Well, that's quite suspicious. It's something a kidnapper would say. <laughs> you went through a lot up till now, so you have trouble trust- Oh, shit! My bad. But the world is also full of amazing people. You don't have to be so pessimistic. Sorry, but words coming out of a Monokuma's mouth aren't exactly persuasive. Hey, where is the safe place you're talking about? 
full disclosure, there's a secret base here underground where adults are living in hiding. S secret base? Did you hear that, Toko? A secret base with adults gathered there. We should go there too, right? Hey, what do you think? I mean, what should we do? E even though it was hard enough to find an exit, you want to keep going through the underground? Uh, but it's dangerous to use those stairs. There are tons of Monokumas lurking around the exit. Huh? See? So wouldn't it be a smarter idea to find the secret base? That doesn't mean this guy's telling the truth. He is a Monokuma, after all. I just want to save you. If you come with me, you can see whether or not I'm telling the truth. You hear that? What do we do? If you think we shouldn't, then I'll go with you. But logically, this is the best option, right? This is the kind of chance that, like, 100 out of 100 people would take. Just be honest and say you want to go. Jeez, you're annoying. <laughs> Fine. You want me to go? Then I'll go. Right. Then let's do that! All right. I'll lead. So follow me. Yeah! I'll leave it to you, Shirakuma. Excuse me. There we go. Yeah, but uh, what about the over secret there. over there? We gotta go over there! Yeah, one Which second. way is over there? Shit. Jeez, it? you're a terrible navigator. Back here. Why is she following me? It's no good. It's locked. No problem. Leave it to me. Leave it to you. What are you gonna do? What? It went inside. It came out. Ta-da! It's unlocked now. Amazing! That's a pretty convenient body. A convenient body? That's a pretty strange way to put it. Yeah, it is. Anyways, screw that door. I'm gonna go... back to the other door. It's always a good idea. Damn it! This area must have been flourishing too. All right, give me this door. Thank you. I'm just so expecting something. Skill up. Yeah. I must have missed a skill. Take any damage.
Hmm. Oh. So cruel. How can they be so cruel? They? You're the same as them. So, I felt like that was the most reasonable option there was to, uh, just <laughs> dart, because there is a grading skill or whatever on how much you use, um, Toko. If you don't use your whole shit ton, then you get more points. Kind of how it works. <laughs> so the knockback thing worked really well. everywhere for these. Did I just see something? No. I've been looking everywhere for those things and I feel like I've missed a bunch of them, but who knows. I don't know how long this chapter is. It's that arcade machine again. Let's get a move on. Looks like we have to time it just right. Okay. Wait, hold on. There's a move command, right? Okay. Turn around, fuckers. Surprise that didn't work. I'm surprised that didn't work. Whatever. Got five out of six. So whatever. Amazing. You two sure are strong. Not me. It's all thanks to this gun. You talked big, but you ended up being killed by Monokumas just like the others. Uh, How horrible. What? Hmm, did you know this guy or something? No, I have no idea who he is. But an adult killed by children, he didn't do anything wrong. I never get used to seeing it, it's the worst tragedy our society has ever seen. You're a sentimental one. Uh, well, if only I had more power. If I was stronger, I could have prevented this. Um... It's not your fault, Shirokuma. Come on, cheer up. Thank you. Strange that this guy's already so close with her. Weird. Mm. 
Hmm. Oh god. Look in the mirror. That fucking creepy ass. That was a close one. Fuck that thing. Gross. Trust you. But I'm really not your enemy. What do I need to do to have you guys trust me? You were suspicious from the start. Awfully convenient to just run into us down here. <laughs> were you perhaps waiting for us? It's true that I did coincidentally see you guys go down here, so I came down to wait. <laughs> you see? I knew it! You were waiting for us from the start! <laughs> but it was just so I could save you. I swear. I was watching you for a bit, and you seemed like you were in trouble, so I wanted to save you. What? Save? We're the ones who saved you, remember? Oh, I'm so ashamed. <laughs> Why did you want to save us? No reason in particular. I just want to save people. That's all. Huh? There's no way I should be the only one keeping his fur white during hard times like this. Toko, this one is definitely... Even if it is telling the truth, it's still really weird. I mean, just because it has an AI, why does that make it act different than the other Monokumas? You can ask, but even I'm not sure myself. The only thing I can say is that I have an AI with a personality. A special thought process. I, feel I don't like... know who put this AI in me, or for what purpose. I feel like it's either Nagito or, um... You don't even know that? Monica. But it's the same with humans, right? They don't know where they came from, and why, right? Knowing that made me feel like... I never want to be lost. I have a heart, and I'll follow it. Hmm. That's amazing. <laughs> you think so? Don't be so impressed by some talking bear. Get a hold of yourself. I can't help it. It's not like I'm special or anything. I'm just a normal girl. I'm getting really tired of hearing that. <laughs> Same. Now then, now that that's cleared up, it's about time we move along. It's not cleared up at all. <laughs> See, if we go through there, we can get into the sewer. Huh? Gross. We're going into the sewer? Yeah, the secret base is hidden there. Oh, but the other Monokumas don't know about it, so shh. I've got my eye on you, bear. I feel like the wristband is a tracker, too, which would make sense. It's dark and smelly. Oh. Wait, so if the Monokuma don't know... I wasn't talking about me. Don't say something so cruel. Roger.
Hmm, which one was the speed one again? I think it was this one. Effectiveness. Knockback? <laughs> Sorry. There are. You're here. Good. I guess I shouldn't have interrupted that, but. What should we do? Is there a way to get across? <laughs> you better not say swim. Polluted water like this is full of bacteria. Ugh. It'll be okay. Just leave it to me. <laughs> Wait for me here. If I turn the handle on that side, I can extend the bridge to get across. <laughs> that was a bang. So feeble. Thank you, Shirakuma. <laughs> These people, 
They had a family, right? Where did it go? Thank you. Is that it? Okay. Omaru, knock them back and drop them! Kinda of what I figured was gonna be a game player here. Something came out. Nice. Skip that one, thank you. I'm kind of generous with the saves in this game. Like <laughs> that's sort of like the Mario song, but not Mario. Just wait a bit here. I can extend the bridge just like last time. So now I gotta protect her. Ugh. <laughs> Mm. 
God damn it. I fucking hate this angle. There. than it should have, but I fucked up on that first one. Thank you, Shirakuma! Oh, wasn't I didn't there, really was do it? much, but I guess I was pretty cool back there. <laughs> well, aren't we humble? Hmm. Been a while since Looks I've seen like the one children of have gotten bored of this game. Guess this is how games get forgotten. For some reason, that sounded very. Hmm. Rather than fight against them one at a time, we should defeat them all at once. There's only two. There's only two. So, if I could get those, please. Was there any? Yeah, there was. Look at a character's duck. Item. Give me the item. get it, but why not try going inside them, one after the other? Wouldn't that be dangerous? Oh, then I guess ignoring it for now is best. Ten birds sit on a fence. An experienced gunman says wants to get rid of them. This rifle.
Okay, but first... Okay. A written challenge? Looks like we have to solve the riddle this kid is going to give us. So what I can discern, you get an item if you're right, and Monokuma's attack you if you're wrong. Sounds like a pretty shitty game to me. Let's just ignore the brat and turn around. Wouldn't that just be running away from this kid's challenge? It would be shameful. Why do you care so much about this? Mm. <laughs> Wants to get rid of them with his rifle. Shot, huh? But it's one. I'm gonna punish you. Oh, I made a mistake. Huh? Oh, what are you doing? Stop it. Next time. Whatever, it's gonna be one. That's what I thought. Because one gunshot will scare them all away. Boosh! Who's the boss? <laughs> yeah. against kids yeah I sure hope not <laughs> so I fucked that up that's it oh my god There's a thing over there. to be a secret base here? I knew it. You tricked us. Omaru, don't hold back. Shoot this traitor. No, you're wrong. The secret base is up here when you climb the ladder. Come on, follow me. Oh, but I wanted to keep going. Climb the ladder first. Huh? Why is that? We might both be girls, but I'd die if you saw my underwear. Well, then, even if I see them on accident, I'll be sure not to tell you. there'd be an underground base like this it's an old warehouse where they used to store water tanks 
The kids don't know about it. Um, what's with those trailers? I brought them here to make it a little easier for everyone to live. <laughs> Aren't I strong? I might not look like it, but I'm built the same way as a Monokuma. Might not look like it? You look exactly like a Monokuma. Since you're here, you might as well talk to everyone. You can talk to me after. You one-sided idiot. It's not like I want to talk to them. Hmm. I see a thing. I'm gonna get the thing first, and then I'll talk to people. Leading up to it. It's not a thing over there, is there? The ones who just came in look pretty young. You better not be on the side of the kids. Uh, of course not. Exactly what part of this voluptuous body is childish? <laughs> yes. Well, if Shirakuma brought you guys, we don't have to worry. We can trust him. Were you also brought here by Shirakuma? Yeah, all the people here were. We were all saved by Shirakuma. I don't like this. Well, hey, sorry to be rude, but I don't really feel like talking. You can chat with someone else. <laughs> Was that guy in a bad mood or something? I don't trust Shirakuma. He just doesn't understand, acting all aloof. He doesn't know real cool. I want Master Byakuya to teach him a lesson. Wait, no. I want Master Byakuya to teach me a lesson. <laughs> oh. Please, no. Okay. Why, hello there. You must be new. I hope we get along well together. Yeah, same here. Is now really the time for friendly greetings? Stuffed inside this dust-covered hole? Well, there's nowhere else to go. You guys saw how terrible they are, right? To actually kill people for fun. They're all insane. I hate them. Even if they're kids. If they pushed me. You what? You're just sitting around waiting for an opportunity to fight back? Is that it? No. It'd be reckless to attack now. They have an army of Monokumas. We couldn't win. Yeah, so just as I thought. You're all talk. I figured. What's with you guys? If you're just here to offend people, then goodbye. Storms off mad. <laughs> mad. Just looking at those kinds of people frustrate me. It's my runtime right They're now. just giving up. Uh, an hour three? It's not bad. I was hoping I could That's get through chapter two tonight. Probably though. because it can't be helped. It can't be helped? Why? They know how powerless they are. The only thing they can do is admit they can't do anything. And that's why we're all cooped up inside this dust-covered dungeon. I mean, this place is really dusty. I, I might just... Please don't. Please? No, don't! Hold it in! It's okay. I got it. I got it. That was close. <laughs> what a relief. It's that chick. But there's other people here first. Boring people. Um, are you hurt? Are you okay? Uh, it's pretty bad, don't you think? The kids did it. If Shirakuma hadn't been there to save me, I would have been. He risked his life. Shirakuma. Shirakuma saved our lives. If he weren't around, everyone here would be dead by now. 
You saw his wounds, right? He got those trying to help us all. I can't thank him enough. <laughs> Actually thanking a Monokuma. Don't do that! Don't bump him in with the other Monokumas! Togo, like you don't crit. have to be so prickly. I just said how I feel. Jeez, what kind of world is this? Huh. I'm like trying to piece it together in my own head here. But I feel like... I feel like this is uh, all leading to something else to happen down the line. I don't like it. There's nothing up there. Either. That's one from um, the hit list, right? Hello. Yeah. Oh, maybe not. What a rude woman. Not so friendly, is she? Well, sorry about that. <laughs> you heard that? I have sharp ears. I can even hear things I don't want to hear. It's a pain. If you two plan on staying here, it might be better if you cover your ears as much as possible. Because eventually, you'll get sick of it. Sick of it? I can't really get along with the people here. If you're so unsatisfied with this place, why don't you just leave? Well, that's a good point. Staying here isn't going to improve the situation any. But what I can accomplish by myself is limited. Since that's the case, I'm better off being here. Hmm. Oh. Uh, that wristband! Your wristband's the same too, right? This is my first time meeting an ally. Are you a target in those brats game too? Yeah. How about that? Of all people, I can't believe I was turned into a toy for those kids. Um... Are there others like us, who have wristbands on them? Well, I'm not sure about the precise number, but there are plenty. The others are somewhere in this town, probably shuddering in fear. If possible, I want to save them, and bring them here. Save? You? No, of course not me personally, but some of the adults here. Listen, everyone other than Shirokuma isn't allowed outside. But they can sneak out. Actually, sometimes I have adults bring back cigarettes from the outside. I can't believe they actually listen to you. It's not hard. I use a woman's special charm. It's especially effective in situations like this. Boobs. Of course, you girls aren't full adults yet, so you won't be able to really use your charm. I feel like Komaru could, maybe. Yeah. But anyway, that's the gist of it. If you ever see someone with a wristband or clues, let me know. We have to save them before they get killed off by the brats. Yeah, understood. Oh, that's right, I almost forgot. The name's Hiroko Hagakure. I'm once divorced and currently single. My age is a secret. <laughs> My name is Komaru Naegi. Pleased to meet you. Uh, Hagakure? What a surprise. Doesn't seem like the older sister. Maybe the mother? Hagakure. The one muttering over there. What's your name? Hold on a second. What? What? No way. Related? It's Toko Fukawa. Okay, noted. You're Coco and Fufu. <laughs> well, why did you use my last name? Who cares? Worrying over little details is bad for the skin, huh? Um. Jeez, half-assing it. You two are definitely related. Huh. Yeah. Um. About this. 
Hmm. Oh, don't tell me. You're right. Yeah, that's exactly what we think it is. A hit list made by those kids for hunting down targets. I picked it up on my way here. One of the children must have dropped it. <sighs> One minute they're going around killing adults, next they're dropping their homework. Pretty creepy, but definitely childlike. What? It's beyond creepy, it's psychotic. Like baking a delicious cake only to take pictures of it instead of eating it. Aww. Yeah, that is pretty hmm. crazy. Setting aside the cake for now, let's take a look at the list. Oh damn, this girl's a super hottie. <laughs> I admire girls like her. She looks like a manga heroine. <laughs> girls with faces like that are cheating. They're just piling on makeup. hundred out of a hundred of them do that. And it's even that way. It's been that way for a hundred years. But in the file it says she doesn't wear a lot Don't of makeup. Don't mess with me! The kids are probably lying. They can't tell anyways. Hmm? What do you care if she wears makeup? She's cute, isn't that enough? <sighs> I hate girls who look like her. As an ugly girl, it frustrates me when I see girls covering up with makeup. <laughs> If you're ugly, be proud of it, damn it. That's the ugly girl way. It's be proud. Be all right. Well, come on, Toko. You can't let that bother you. There's more than a woman. More to a woman than her face. What's going on? It's not encouraging at all. I bet if this girl were a team manager, those guys would be really pumped up to win. What kind of idiot would try to hire at sports just to impress some hot girl? Every guy ever. Literally every man ever. Actually, I know one. Mm hmm. Hmm? An acquaintance of yours? Nothing. Not really. Who cares? <laughs> well, high school boys are like that. They can live a whole month on noth uh, nothing more than <laughs> porn, fried chicken, and manga. Could it be? <laughs> so, does Makoto also? Yeah. No doubt about it. It's true of every high school boy in the whole damn world. No, not Makoto. He's so pure. So pure. Back to the point. Looks like their hunting grounds are unknown. So that means... Me. That means they can't track with the wrists. Okay. I'll convince some of the adults here to help look for her. Convince? Looks like the adults aren't any different than high schoolers sometimes. <laughs> I've got more. Hey, hey! Well, I'll be damned, I never thought this guy would yes? be in town. Do you know him? No. Nah, it's not like that. Look, read this. If it's true, this guy's the father is the prime, former prime minister. Hmm. I bet those brats just made it up. Jeez. You two don't remember? There really was a prime minister named... <laughs> Excuse me. Toranosuke Ishimaru? He was a genius, but didn't do well in school. Despite that, he became the uh. prime minister. But in the end, a scandal ruined him, probably smothered by his own talent. I see. That could be why he was such an uptight idiot. No. No. But the problem is, is... Ishimaru, I heard about him a little too. There was a big stir about him being a cop after his dad got caught. Folks wanted him fired. And now, to top it off, he gets caught up in his own hunt. How unlucky can that guy be? I hope he's safe at least. I feel for him, even if he is a 5-0. But that's neither here nor there. Leave it to me. Toa Science Memorial, huh? Alright, I'll send rescue guys right away. Correct. We'll leave it to you. I'm sure he's afraid of being all by himself. It's gonna be alright. Leave it to me. I'd give him the shirt off my back if he wanted. And with my charm. I'm gonna keep Just this kidding. Even if you can't save anyone, I wouldn't blame you. But it is Danganronpa. It is Danganronpa. It, what if he didn't die when he blew up? Alright. I'm gonna... You know what? I'm gonna hold out some hope. I'm holding out some help. Hmm. Why the long face? Before we picked up the list, we mm. met Yuda. Oh, how's he doing? Why isn't he with you? Aww. Yuda died. The wristband is built to explode if you try to get outside of Toa City. He didn't know that and he tried to swim out. Exploded. Died. 
Unforgivable. Dude, that's just unforgivable. Huh? Dude. What the? An innocent kid lo losing his life to some crazy ass kids. No matter what you think, it shouldn't be allowed. Hey, Miss Higakure. Unforgivable. They might just be kids, but they're gonna get their just desserts. It will cost them at least What's finger. What's going on? I'm sorry, you said you were a former delinquent? Huh? Huh? <laughs> hey, Miss Higakure. Just kidding. Oops, my past self came through a little bit more there. That was totally not a little. <sighs> but more importantly, that's just terrible. An explosion, huh? Poor oh, guy. You had to try to get help for all of us. If he, if he never met us, he wouldn't have. <laughs> it's not your fault, Coco. All boys really want to do is act. All boys really want to do is act cool in front of girls. Oh, sorry, I was just. It's just hard to think about. It's I'm gonna fine. be all right. Hey, it's fine. If you're gonna be down, you should go as far as <laughs> you like. The more down you are, the easier it is to stand up a little. Aww. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> the older, the wiser, huh? If he really was a blood relative, I wonder if that occult idiot might actually grow useful. Hmm? Did you say something, Toko? Nothing. Nope, just talking to myself. She's like the personification of the, the, the player. <laughs> Alright, anyways. So, everyone here is so nice. There's nothing to worry about, right? If these irritating cowards are nice people, <laughs> this world must not be made up of bad people. And that stranger danger warning would no longer be needed. Wow, such an amazing world. That's the epitome of my ideal. Oh. I was being sarcastic. Oh. Well then, it's about time we went back to the important stuff. This place is used as a conference room, so let's talk inside. Here, come in. Not <laughs> from walking sounds are gross. <laughs> Cutscene? Huh? He's not here. He's usually here, though. Who's not here? The leader of the resistance. I wanted to introduce you guys to him. Can you wait here a little while? I'm sure he'll be back soon. No. Leader? He's probably some old geezer who thinks he can run the show. It's uh, Biakuya. What kind of leader would a pitiful place like this even have? Definitely a useless old man. It's Biakuya. It's raising the flag. If he really is a superior man. He would be in a superior organization. Just like Master. It's Biakuya. And you shouldn't you... have high expectations either, Omaru. <laughs> the flag's risen. Expectations? What kind of expectations? It's Byakuya. It's, it's, it's gotta be Byakuya. I'm just saying. It's most definitely Byakuya. Yeah. It's kinda rude. List of victims. Names of the dead are listed here. List of missing. <laughs> Names of the li missing are listed here. Oh, that's sad. The victims and the missing are divided into two lists. They're both pretty long. It's not even murder at this point. This is war. The kids call it revolution. That's just semantics. Exactly. Call it whatever name you please. In the end, there's still a mountain of bodies. But by calling it a revolution, they justify it in their minds and become even more brutal. By how you're talking, you seem to know these brats pretty well. You're talking about the warriors of hope who lead the Monokuma kids, right? From what I know, they were apparently students of an elementary school affiliated with Hope's Peak. Hope's Peak Academy? Why would that name come up now? What about it? Did something happen before? Kamaru, you don't know? Not just something. But forget about it for now. It's a very long story. How do you not know, Kamaru? More on the subject. I never expected the Academy to also have an elementary. They're not technically affiliated. Attending Hope's Peak Academy still requires being scouted. 
But the elementary was still prestigious. Many Hope's Peak Academy students came from there. Oh, God. The elementary studied the talents of children. Only child prodigies could attend. What kind of game is this? It's kind of like a light novel series, but with some action in there. It's they're pretty weird. So like the first two, Danganronpa and um, Super Danganronpa Two, they're more of a murder mystery game. And how exactly are they prodigies? They're just a bunch of mental brats. Whereas this one's more actiony. It's pretty cool, in my opinion. I guess that just shows that having a great mind does not always make a great person. Or a child. So, like, this one is more um, action y, but there's a lot of cutscenes because that's just the type of game it is. It's not like a. I don't know. A child's talent can easily be corrupted into something evil. Those five are the worst example. Actually, the warriors of hope were all in the classroom with the trouble children. Oh. Troublemakers, huh? Just as I thought. They were all deviants from the start. It might be more accurate to say that they own talent not even the teachers could control. One second. Looking at my Snapchat. Oh. Okay. What an asshole. <laughs> Alright, I'm back. Excuse me. It more horrifying is that they're still kids. They kill without guilt or mercy. You remember what you were like when you were children? How many cool things you did? Insane because they're too pure. Uncontrollable because they're too innocent. Children with more potential than adults. With such cruel natures. How horrifying it would be if they were truly out of control. Toa City is an example of that. Hmm. You... you think it's fun to threaten us? It's not like that. I'm just trying to tell you to be careful. Huh. That's none of your business. Huh. So, this is still, um... Like a, a murder mystery game series, but it's different. The sound of the chanting, the screaming like dogs being choked, never leaves my ears. Everyone got killed. Everyone got killed. Devils. They're devils in the bodies of children. Damn devils! Damn devils, damn devils, damn devils! I want to grind down your organs, your heart, your liver, your kidneys, everything into dust. I want to throw you all into a blender and turn you all to slushy livestock feed. I want to stab your eyeballs with a pencil until I can write with your blood. I want to boil you alive in a pressure cooker until your screams stop. Jesus Christ, is this a kid's thing? Holy shit. The, the writing's really sloppy after this. I can't read it. Th that's quite a poetic style they have there. Yeah. I thought he was a little twisted. Shirakuma brought in three new people. I feel happy, but at the same time scared. I wonder how many adults are killed above ground. How many of them got saved? How many bodies are lying there? Thanks to the newbies screaming, sleepless nights continue. From what I can tell, in his dream, his friend gets killed by kids, and he screams out. I can kind of understand how he feels. I can't blame him. The newbie finally broke. Even though he's a grown adult, he ended up acting like a newborn baby. He lost against his nightmares to the kids. Looking at the scenery forces me to realize that, even though I'm here, I couldn't run. Every time a newbie is brought in, my despair increases. I can't even run, nor forget. The children will kill us all. This is pretty... intense. Just reading it makes me dizzy. It's not. Yo, Shirakuma. I heard you were looking for me. That's not the Akuya? I heard you went outside again without my permission. Didn't I tell you it's dangerous? So, two more newcomers? 
Let's not be Yaku, yeah. Name's Haiji Toa. I'm the leader of the resistance here. What a surprise. He's pretty handsome. <laughs> uh, I'm uh, Toko Fukawa. I hope we get along well. I'm Kamara Naegi. Uh, um, so, a girl who's filthy and a girl who's clean. Which one do you prefer? <laughs> um, if your last name is Toa, does that mean that. Yeah, I'm from the Toa family. Haiji's father is a chairman of Toa Group. Then you're a son of a distinguished family? And the Toa Group, too. You must be very. <laughs> I thought she only had eyes for Byakuya. Ah, I'm getting a little hot from all this excitement. I don't mind if you help me cool. Got it. Leave it to my special cooling device. I, I didn't water. ask you. It's water. She needs water for her thirst. Well, I'll tell you right now, I don't have status or money or anything. Those kids took it. Thanks to them, I lost everything. Toa group. Even the whole damn Toa city. Uh, by the way, uh, do you happen to know who's uh, leading the children? Who knows? Then, do you maybe know why Toa city became a target? Sorry, I don't really know much about Toa's situation. Didn't really do anything there. And the one who would have all the answers, my dad. He's been missing since the riots. He's, He's hiding same. somewhere. I, I'm the same. I don't know where my parents are either. So I... I want to go home no matter what. Please, tell me how to get out of this city. Well, if there is a way to escape, I'd love to know. Huh? All the roads that connect to the outside are blocked completely. And it wouldn't matter anyway. That wristband. Those kids put it on you, right? I, I know it will explode if I try to leave, but... Does anyone know how to take it off or something? N no I want to help, but... I'm sorry. It's just not possible. However, no need to get too down about that. At least this place is safe. Those brats don't even know this place exists. Y you're telling us just to hide here? It's not like you can escape anyway. Staying put and keeping quiet is the best move right now. But I want to fight. You're I have a gun. You're right. But I have At a gun. Least as long as I'm here. Why don't you fight? Hmm? Isn't this a resistance? An organization created to fight these little brats, right? Then why don't you just fight? Fight? That'd be suicide. We have no guns. See this arm? Your arm? Did a Monokuma do it? Yeah. Got crushed. Crumbled up like paper. The whole thing only took a split second. And those brats were... laughing. Like it was fun to them. While I was screaming, bleeding. They're not kids. Not anymore. They're devils. Devils? Well, the bright side is, even my nerve endings were crushed, so I don't even feel the pain. Of course, that just means it'll never fully heal. So basically, your will got shattered along with that arm of yours, right? Huh? And that's why you're sitting here. Moping and pitying yourself, right? What the? You sure got harsh. Th that nice girl act was just for your benefit. I got information now, using my womanly charm. Huh? An act? Uh, of course. I belong to Master Byakuya only. There's no way I'd give my heart to some mole of a man, hiding underground like a coward. It's not like I'm going to hide forever. I'm just waiting for the right opportunity to strike. Excuses. Save them for your psychiatrist. Huh. <laughs> What's the point of fighting back knowing that you die? It's all for nothing if you're dead. It's true. The way you are now, you might as well be. Rude. Toko, that's too far! I'm saying it to you too. Huh? 
Weren't you going to fight against those brats? What are you doing sympathizing with these people? Yeah, okay. Maybe you are just an average, common, ordinary character with no special talents. A drab girl who lacks presence and charm with no athletic or intellectual skills. But what's wrong with that? Someone who just keeps making excuses and doesn't even try to fight back? You're worse than dead. Totally worthless. Wh why are you being so cruel? Hey now, I'm sure Toko didn't mean it like that. Oh, yes I did. Just looking at you frustrates me. You remind me of myself in the past. <laughs> No matter how much pain or despair you feel, nothing will change if you keep denying it. So why don't you just try to change it yourself? No matter how scary the situation was, he faced it head on and moved forward. Thanks to that, I'm alive today. Uh, talking about Makoto? Wh what are you talking about? Rushing forward at full speed with no hope of success isn't courage. It's stupidity. Uh, who's stupid? Well... Do you have a plan? Do you know of some way to get out of here? Do you know how to remove a wristband? Y yeah of course. Uh, I I'm sure Future Foundation technology can get it off easily. Huh? Ah, uh, I was just saying. It's not like we can contact Future Foundation anyway. Wait, hold on. What did you just say about Future Foundation? Don't tell me you're just gonna leave it up to those guys. W what do you mean? Uh, um, Togo is a member of Future Foundation. What? What did you say? Hi, G. If that's the case, then I'm sorry, but get the fuck out of here. I refuse to cooperate with you. Ooh, saucy. Ultra saucy. Hey! What happened? Why did he get angry all of a sudden? Let's go. Huh? But, uh... He told us to get out. We can't stay here. Y you're right, but. No. I have another thing to explore. <sighs> Give me the thing. See? Always worth to explore. I could just end this chapter here, because I'm going on a long time here. What is that? Oh man, yeah, I think... Someone help! That's my wife! Please, calm down. I can't. I can't just stay calm looking at this! This is a trap! They're just trying to flush us out! Why fall for their cheap tricks? Did something happen? It might be better if you guys didn't look. Huh? Why? Just it's because the again. adults managed to make their way here, it doesn't mean they're saved. As long as we're helpless against the children, there will be no future for the adults here. But there's no need for you guys to worry about that. I'm sure you're already troubled enough. Then I won't think about it. Who won't do any good anyway? And sorry about earlier. I never thought Haiji would react like that. It seems as if he hates Future Foundation. Who, who cares? I'm not interested in those who are beneath me. Rude. Anyway, the exit's over there, right? Huh? Leaving already? You should at least stay the night. If I had to spend a night in this dump, oh, I, I would rather leap into the arms of a Monokuma. Aren't you being a bit too dramatic? 
They're probably planning to attack us while we sleep. Oh, or take funny pictures of our sleepy faces. Oh no, a sleeping face shot would be bad. But it's already nighttime, and underground, it's going to be even darker. Huh? D dark already? I guess I've got no choice. If you insist, just for one night. <laughs> All right. Oh, let me... See, this place is a private room. It's usually used for the injured and sick. Private room? No matter what you call it, this is a prison cell. No, it's not. It just looks like one, but it's not. Well, this is the only place there is, so we got no choice. Um, about what you mentioned before, are you really a member of Future Foundation, Toko? So what if I am? And if you make contact with them, they will come and save us? Well, yeah, but reaching them is the problem. It's true that it will be difficult, but it's not impossible. I'd like you to have this. An uplink computer? This is... It's the newest wireless device Togami Group developed. It can send audio and video. Oh. It wasn't available to the public, but groups like the police and Future Foundation use it. So, if we use this, we can call Future Foundation? Really? We can? No, it's not that easy. Because of the jamming. Jamming? Like... Raspberry? Come on, Kamaru. He means radio interference. Thanks to the signal jamming everywhere in Toa, this device can't be used in town. Then why give it to us? You want us to throw it away for you or something? No, it's not that. The jamming radio waves are emitted from a huge building called Toa Hills. If you send a signal from a higher spot, you should be able to avoid the jamming. And of all the buildings in this city, there's one that just might work. And it's not far. A skyscraper called Toa Tower. It's a huge tower, a landmark of Toa City. That building is taller than Toa Hills, so you should be able to send a signal from there. Then if we go there, we can call Future Foundation? If you already knew about this, why didn't you just use other adults? Why us? It's impossible for anyone here. Monokumas are patrolling outside, after all. But I've seen you two fight. You can beat those Monokumas and make it to the tower. But, but that Mole Man said he didn't want to rely on Future Foundation. I'm sure he'll understand. If Future Foundation comes, his people will be saved as well. Of course, I won't force you. No doubt about it. This will be a dangerous mission. I wish I could do it myself. To tell you the truth, I'm jealous of you two. I wish I had the power to protect people. Hey, Toko? I, I know. You want me to decide, right? No. Well, it's been decided. Even if a competent adult were to go, it'd be too dangerous. I want to go. Oh. What? I know it's dangerous, but we found a way to survive up until now. So, I want to keep trying. Keep going forward. I understand how you feel, but maybe you should think this over. W what happened, Toko? Earlier you were telling me to stop hiding and fight back. N no, it's just... Well, I guess it's better than just rotting away here. When I think of it that way... Then... we are going? For now, we'll check it out. We'll see about contacting Future Foundation when we're there. Looks like you made your decision. Thank you so much. I'm grateful for your courage. Well, make sure you get plenty of rest today so you're prepared for tomorrow. Thank you. I'm finally starting to see some hope. Thanks to you, Shirakuma. Shirakuma, Aww. thank you so much. Aww. Oh, good for you. 
Uh, tight and bouncy hug from a high school girl is priceless. Uh. <laughs> <sighs> <sighs> so c cold, Master Biakia. Gross. It's morning. Yeah, sure is. Of course, there's no real way to tell underground. But still, I feel refreshed. I was able to get a really good night's sleep. You're the only one who slept well. How can you just fall asleep so fast like that? Okay then, now I'll tell you how to get to Toa Tower. After you climb the ladder, go the opposite way you came from. That will take you above ground. A little bit past that, there will be a river. Follow the river, and you'll find the tower. Doesn't sound like it's too far away. It's miles. It's miles and a labyrinth or two and a mini boss and a final boss away. The, the problem isn't the distance. It's the Monokumas between here and there. Well, it's gonna be all right. I'm sure of it. Why do you say that? You have no reason to think that whatsoever. You're the reason, Toko. You might be worried for whatever reason, but with you around, there's no need to worry. What? That doesn't even make sense. Just leave it to us. We'll definitely get a message off to Future Foundation. You two be careful. Have a safe trip. I wanted to use that same point. They said to go the opposite way from where we came. Uh, I wanted to end it a while ago, but of course I can't. Well, I know there's a thing there, so I'm gonna do that quick. Also, I'm gonna grab some ammo. to save there. Why? Why do you do this to me? But your shit comes at me. And I won't like it. It's a manga. This is it. This is number one. What do you mean this is number one? This is not funny at all. All the books in the world, this refuse known as light novels is my number one most hated. They have shit on so many things in this game. I, no, I take it back. Light novels shouldn't even be counted as books. They're literally waste paper. This is really shitting on stuff. No, not even. I wouldn't even wipe my ass with this. Light novels are the worst waste of paper ever. Um... Well, I obviously don't read them either, but surely some of them aren't so bad. They say tastes grow over time, or so maybe if you give it another shot. It's almost as bad as people that play fucking visual don't novels. Don't mess with me! <laughs> you couldn't pay me to give light novels another shot. <laughs> it's a pretty thorough hatred you have there. You said you don't read them either, right? That makes me think that maybe for the first time I can see you as a human being. Aww. Aww. Aww rude. <laughs> what did you see me as before? And? So that kind of liter so what kind of literature do you fancy? Postmodernism? Romanticism? You better not tell me you like Victorian novels with a straight face. Um, I don't know how it's classified. I'm just really in I'm really just into manga. Uh, manga, that's not literature. It's not even a novel. Well, it's a graphic novel, and there's tons of different kinds. You should try it reading. Uh, Collaborations from failed storyboard artists and English major dropouts. <laughs> no thanks. <laughs> this is fucking scathing. Manga's a waste of resources too, just like light novels, maybe worse. Hey, you can make fun of me all you want, but if you make fun of manga you've crossed a line, I won't forgive you. Where did all this passion Jeez. come from? I mean, reading manga is like my only hobby. I'm proud of the fact that I'm well read. If you don't like it, 
when people make fun of stuff you think you don't like it when people make fun of stuff you think is important, right? Don't mess with me. Don't you dare talk about novels and your little picture books as if they're on the same level. <laughs> when you say they're here more well raised, more re eh. it's too late. When you say you're more well read than others, I bet that means you only read like one a week. I see through you. You're just a self declared otaku. <laughs> For a high school girl, one a week is a lot. I have to buy them with my allowance, after all. And what's important is the quality, not the quantity, and it's about the love of the medium. Now, hold on a hold on a fucking second. Hold on a second. She was in fucking... She was in prison for a year and a half. How does she know? Were they giving her manga in her fucking prison? You know what I think? I think your mind is trying to protect itself from that garbage. You're subconsciously allowing yourself to only read one a week. Two would probably kill you. <laughs> oh. Well, you're so frustrating. No one makes, no one makes fun of manga. And making fun of me for not reading a lot of them. That's just because I refuse to buy used. <laughs> yeah, your love of terrible manga is so gross. That's not it. That's, they're not. They're not What's terrible. What's going on? Fine, but you're still gross. Oh. <laughs> this fucking game. Holy shit. Alrighty then. Let me guess, Monokuma around the corner. Looks like we can get out if we climb that ladder. <laughs> Finally, at long last! That kinda does go up there, doesn't it? Oh, this place is a graveyard. What the fuck happened to the colors? Did I just look away from the screen long enough for that? Looks like it. It doesn't just look like it. It's clearly a graveyard. What happened to the color palette? This whole town is basically a graveyard anyway. At least this place buried the bodies. That's not the problem. I've had the ability to see ghosts ever since I was a kid. What? Oh, really? <laughs> if you like the occult, I know just the guy you should meet. He's even more of an idiot than you. You'd really hit it off. What do you say? Oh, she's so rude. Well, well first we have to get out of here. I don't like this color palette, dude. It's making me feel queasy. Aha! You thought you could hide from me, you little shits. Oh my god, my I'm eyes. Sure some pretty girl designed it. My eyes. <laughs> my fucking eyes. I can't see anything. <laughs> okay, I'll talk to this guy. Okay. My options are okay and not okay. I'm pretty fucking far from not okay. We're pretty fucking far from okay. Well, we're not exactly okay either. I don't think a single adult in this town is okay. Maybe. But that doesn't make me feel any better. Never expected something like this. Been living here ten years. Ten years? You're from here? Then do you know why the children are acting like this? Who knows? I don't have a friggin' clue. But I do I do know what they've done. They, those kids, they killed my family and made a diorama with the bodies. Hey. Can you imagine it? Seeing your family's bodies nailed to a wall, next fixed into position with a wire, and knowing you just, you just have to hide and watch them do it. Can't imagine it, can you? 
That's fine. That's normal. You shouldn't have to imagine something like that your whole damn life. Shit. So why? Why me? I wish I could be normal again. I wish I hadn't seen it. What did I do? What did I do to deserve this? Oh, the shelter at least, you. Okay, anyways. I am going to save and end the stream here. I will bring you part two, hopefully, of chapter two tomorrow. I just I just can't play games anymore. My eyes are wearing out. So thanks for watching the one or two people that have joined. And have a good night. Oops, no 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 no. Where am I going here? There we go. Alright, so thank you all for watching.